Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel, or welcome if you're new. My name is Veda and this is The Simple Budget. Here on my channel, I show you how my family is using the zero-based budgeting method in order to get out of debt and simplify our financial life. If that sounds like content that you're interested in, I would love it if you would hit the subscribe button and join our little crew here. And with that being said, let's get into today's video. Well, hello everyone and happy Wednesday. Um, actually, first and foremost, we are going to address the elephant in the room and that is my injury. <laughs> I injured myself at work and um, I was actually opening a bottle and it was broken and I didn't realize that it was broken and I was predominantly using my pointer fingers to like twist it and that's how I injured both of these. And so rather than having open wounds on my channel here. I decided to cover them up with band-aids. And then also my nails are just in an absolute state, but I'm asking you to forgive and ignore the, both of these things. <laughs> Hopefully. Hopefully you can. Anyways, um, today is always a fun video for me to film because it is my Etsy and YouTube cash stuffing and it is a specific opportunity for me to say thank you. Thank you to all of you for supporting me here on my channel. Um, for those of you who do not know, when you um, hit a certain amount of subscribers and watch hours on YouTube, you are eligible to receive ad revenue. And um, I am one of the beneficiaries of that. And so every time you s do not skip an ad, but you watch it, I get a small portion of the ad revenue from that particular ad. Um, I don't know what it is. I don't know how they calculate it. I don't know what those magic numbers are, but regardless, I am very grateful to be on the receiving end of that. And I'm grateful to all of you for watching them so that I can get this payout every month. It is definitely a lovely boost to our personal family finances. And I cannot thank you guys enough for supporting us in this way. Uh, likewise, this is also the all of the money that I earned in the month of November um, from my Etsy shop, which is another thing that I am so, so grateful for. Uh, so many of you um, purchased from me. I have a lot of repeat buyers, which I'm very flattered by because I take that as you liking my products and I'm grateful for that. Um, and so many of you um, purchased from my shop for um, the Thanksgiving week sale as well. Um, and just something to note actually in my shop, since I'm talking about my shop, I'm going to moving forward, I'm going to have a regular supply of Oops, Oops products as they're made. Um, because I don't like to put out a subpar product, obviously for people who are purchasing from my shop, but every now and then some dust or debris or fuzz gets stuck underneath of the laminating sheet and, so there are little particles and I don't like to actually turn that over to somebody as a product that they've paid full price for. Um, and so it happens. And so I'm just gonna make them a regular part of my shop rather than like releasing them every so often. I'll just kind of always keep replenishing as I get them in. So they're gonna be odd odds and ends here and there, but I figure, you know, if you want one of my shop products at a heavily discounted price, that's a good way of doing it. So that's what I'll be doing moving forward. Anyways, of course I was interrupted. It's never it's never a simple budget video without an interruption here and there. Certainly not a cash stuffing. Um, speaking of, today is actually going to be the last cash stuffing that I do before I condense all of these envelopes. By the time that you're watching this video, um, the bill condensing will have already gone live. Um, and I do appreciate your <laughs> understanding for the like wonky way that we've filmed and uploaded some of these videos, but sometimes this is just the way the cookie crumbles. I wanted to make sure that I got out content in a reasonable format um, rather than like condensing so many videos into like two weeks I've decided to just kind of spread them out and so this was the date that I chose for the Etsy and YouTube stuffing because it just made the most sense to me to put up the budget with me last week since um, it was like you know the last day of November and so obviously I wanted December's budget with me to go up around the beginning of December so 
we are going to go ahead now and get started stuffing this cash. Um, it is $1,205 that we're going to be stuffing today. And I am just going to go ahead and jump into my business binder first since it's actually, it houses the least amount of um, the envelopes that I'm stuffing. First up is materials and it's getting $144. And um, I just did this normally and this is like anything that I need to actually per or make the products in my shop. So the vellum, the laminating sheets, um, card stock, like things like that. And what did I say, 144. Let me just, one, two, three, four. Oh, oh my goodness. Definitely needing a condensing in all of the envelopes, goodness. All right, so now in materials, I have 100, 200, 20, 40, 60, 80, 300, 10, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, and 331. Um, I know I've mentioned this before, but I do a percentage, and so it may be an odd number to you, but, um, and it is, I know that some of these are odd numbers, but um, I just, that's how I work it out. I actually, I roll up to every dollar, and sometimes I move dollars around if I feel like I wanna fill in a gap here or there, but mostly I just stick to the percentage that I have. And my percentage changes all the time. I actually get asked that question a lot. Um, but with materials, I always try to put at least 15 to 25% back into materials um, because they are pricey and they fluctuate. So I wanna make sure that I'm providing enough padding for myself to replenish materials as I need to. Equipment is up next and I'm going to be stuffing it $65 today. Did I do? Yes, okay, I just wanted to make sure I did this normal. 50, oops, 65, so 60, oops, five. That was a weird way of trying to do that. Now on equipment, I have 50, 70, 90, 110, 120, 30, 5, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49, and 150. And this is gonna be like, if I need to replace like my laminator, um, eventually my printer, but my printer is new, so that should not need to be a thing that happens. Um, hole punches, corner punches, things like that that I use to actually facilitate like making the envelopes themselves or dashboards or um, placeholders, which I sell all of in my shop. It's always linked below too if you're interested. Shipping supplies, poor little thing is empty. And this one I added a little bit more of a higher of a percentage to in my last Etsy pay of the month because um, I was realizing that I go through this one a little bit more frequently than I had originally anticipated. So I went ahead and stuffed this one 38. So 20, 30, 5, 36, 37, and 38. And that's all we've gotten here. Um, but I'll probably start adding a little bit higher of a percentage to this one. I was only doing this like 2% and I think I'm going to have to bump it up to 5% just based on how frequently I actually pull from this one. Uh, YouTube is up next. It's getting $64 and I think I did this one. I only stuff with my YouTube check and I think I did like 25% of what I earned or something like that. It was like somewhere in that neighborhood. So 50 60. I'm sure the not rounding to 65 is bothering some of you. I am sorry, but I I don't know why. I just like to stay with whatever number comes up on the calculator. <laughs> so that's what I did. And now in YouTube, I have 50, 100, 20, 30, 45, 46, 47, 48, and 49. So 149 in YouTube. That's nice. I still have not pulled from this. I mean, maybe by the time you guys are watching it, I will have gotten out all of the prizes to all of my giveaway winners from my 5k giveaway. But, um, while, like while I'm filming this, I still haven't pulled from it fully completely to do that yet. So that's why it's got so much in there. 
Canva's up next. It's getting $10, and this is just this pays for the annual um, Canva Pro membership that I have. I use Canva for all of my for my shop to make like my envelopes and stuff. And so I pay for the pro account because you get more fonts and stuff like that. And every now and then I do feel like a font font change up. So um, you never know when I'm gonna utilize that pro account and all of the little options that are available for it. So now on Canva, I have 20, 40, 50, 60. And this is due, um, it's like a hundred and something, 120 and it's due in June. So I just paid for it this year, so it's not to do until, again, until June of 2024. So I have a little bit of time to build that one up. P.O. Box is a funny one. So I went to go open my P.O. Box. Hopefully by the time you guys are seeing this video, I will have gotten it and it will be linked or I'll have the P.O. Box listed below. But um, I went to go do it and they needed like mail and documentation for proof of where I live and all that kind of stuff. So. I didn't end up going through with it. So um, that's why I still have the money in here. So now I'll actually be two months ahead by the time I actually get the P.O. box because I've been, um, I stuffed it for enough to get the P.O. box last month and for the next month in the P.O. box to renew it every six months. So it's going to be getting $18 today. That's what it costs. That's going to cost me a month now to just renew it every six months. So 10 15, 16, 17, 18. And now in P.O. Box, I have a 120, 35, 40, 1, 2, 3, and 4. So 144 in my P.O. Box. I'm really, really hoping that by the time you guys are watching this video, I actually have my P.O. Box. <laughs> really hoping. All right. Well, that is it for my business binder. That worked out nicely. I really need to condense these envelopes well. All right, so let's just go right into, nope, that's holiday. High priority sinking funds first because, you know, the blood sucking leeches in Washington, DC have to get theirs. Texas is going to be getting $350. One, two, three. Yes, it is heartbreaking. No, I do not want to discuss it. Obviously, that's the biggest stuff that any of these envelopes are going to get from me. Um, oh, goodness. And now in taxes, I have 1000 in the bank. This is going to be helpful for um, my bill condensing that I have up coming up soon, too. So so 1000 in the bank, and then one, two, three. Oh. Okay, let's try that one more time. One, two, three, four, five, six, fifty, seven, hundred, twenty, thirty, forty, fifty, sixty, five, seventy, one, two, and three. So seventeen twenty-three, I think that's what I said. Somewhere in that neighborhood. <laughs> seventeen twenty-three. I think that sounds about right. If I'm wrong, one of you will correct me. I just know it. We are going to skip back to clothes. Oh, no. Yeah, clothes, because I don't think anything else in here is being stuffed. I don't usually do that. I don't do high priority ones usually. Um, and I just wanted to supplement clothes just a little bit this month. And so it's getting 34, 20, 30, 1, 2, 3, 4, Again, I know my odd numbers are probably bothering some of you, but just let me have my brain the way that it works, please. <laughs> I know it's weird. I know it's weird that I don't round up, but I don't, I just, I don't mind it, I guess. So now in close, um, and I know some of these numbers are not going to make sense because I actually did our Christmas bonus uh, cash stuffing. I filmed that before I filmed this one even though you're not seeing that one until next week. But this one, I wanted to get this one up first because this was a higher priority to me because it's literally a video in which I say thank you to you guys. And so that's why I prioritized getting this one up first. Um, so my envelopes are gonna look a little weird until all of those videos come out and make sense to you guys. So anyways, that being said, now on close, I have 100, 200, 50, 70, 90, 
300, 10, 20, 30, 40, 5, 46, 47, 48, 49, 50, 51, 52, 53, 54, 55, 56, 57, and 358 in close. We've just really needed to supplement this one for a while, so it feels nice to have this number. There goes Mr. Simple, walking by me all loudly. <laughs> And that's gonna be it for high priority sinking funds because we don't stuff any of this. I, I really try to the best of my ability to use fun money for fun things. Uh, we do pay our debt a little bit with Etsy and YouTube, but for the most part, we supplement our sinking funds with those incomes. So that's how we do that. Um, and here we are gonna go into Dine Out which is gonna be getting $25. I'm sure you're all very happy that that's like a normal whole number. <laughs> so 25. And now in Dine Out, I have 50, 100, 25, 26, 27, 28, and 129 in Dine Out. Uh, work food is being skipped. So is haircuts, home decor, dates is also going to get 25. This one really needs a condensing. Wow. <laughs> wow. Um, 20. Yeah, because this has like very small bills. 25. And now in dates, we have 100, 50, 200, 20, 40, 60, 70, 80, 90, 300. Oh, goodness. Oh. Five, hold on, let me, five, 10, 15, 25, 35, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49, 50, 51, 52, 53, and 354 in dates. So this is definitely plenty to go on a date and pay the babysitter for the month of December, which we're very excited about. Very, very excited about. Long overdue, this date. <laughs> Um, his is up next, and my husband is getting $115 this month. So, $100, a 10, and a 5. And now, in my husband's spending money, he has $500 in the bank, $650, $700, $10, $20, $30, $40, $50, $60, $70, $80, $90, $100, $200, $300, $400, $500, $600, $700, $800, $1,000, $1,000, $1,000, $1,000, $1,000, $1,000, $1,000, $1,000,
house project is getting a really decent stuff, which I'm so excited about. This is, I, it gets the highest, one of the higher percentages of my Etsy and YouTube stuffing. It gets roughly 10 to 15%, which, um, it's just a personal goal of ours because we do have quite a few house projects on our list. We are currently saving to re do my husband's office so that it can also function for me and my Etsy shop. So that is very exciting. And so it's getting $184. So $150, 1, 2, 3, and 4. And so now in house project, we have 100, 200, 300, 50, 400, 50, 500, 50, 600, 50, 70, 90, 710, 730, 50, 70, 90, 810, 830, 45, 55, 65, 75, 76, 77, 78, 79, 80, 81, 82, 83, 84, 85, 86, 87. So 887 in house project, which is exciting. Um, there, there's quite a bit of stuff that we need to get for the office. And so this doesn't really scratch the surface of what we wanna do, but we don't have a goal right now. We're just kind of rolling with it to see what happens, but. <laughs> I think there's no question that this thing needs a bill condensing for sure. <laughs> for sure, for sure. But that's gonna be it for our low priority sinking funds. Okay, last up for our lonely little 20 over here, we are popping into holiday sinking funds and I just wanted to supplement gifts a little bit just because of the time of year and all of that. And so I gave it $20. And so now in gifts, we have 100, 20, 40, 60, 80, 200, 20, 40, 60, 5, 75, 80, 1, 2, 3, and 4. So 284 in gifts, which is very, very, very nice. All right. Well, that is going to do it for today's Etsy and YouTube cash stuffing. Again, I'm so, so grateful to you guys for your support of me my channel, my Etsy shop. It just means so much to me. I really cannot say thank you enough and I don't want it to sound disingenuous, but I really mean it when I say thank you. Thank you, thank you. Um, that's it. If you enjoyed today's video, please go ahead and give me a thumbs up and leave me a comment down below. And then, you know, this is just bonus content Wednesday. So I'm gonna see you guys on Friday with a regular weekly check-in. And I look forward to those every single time. I hope you guys have a great rest of your day and I will see you then. Bye everyone. Mm -hmm.